Well, Otacon isn't going to be as long because. Yeah. Of- but we got to end this one right here because um we can't go past an hour. No, no, that's fine for no, no. That's for like recording like the Elgato stuff. Oh, okay, I didn't like the mic did. stuff is fine. Oh, I didn't know if it, the mic skipped or not. All right, so this. All right, so so this- we're now we're done with two, like because like most like I said most of our t- talkies were going to be at about too many games because. You know all the prices changes and stuff because it was because I even I knew it good leading up to Otakon because this is like what our fourth fifth time going there. Um, we went there twice when I was younger, like in the teens, like low teens, like I think 2012, mm-hmm. put out 13, 2011 ish, and then we we came back to it in 2021 after uh, the pandemic. Yeah, so 2021, 2022. And 2003. So we went. We went five times. You guys, yeah. Uh, Manny went. I don't know. I started going back in 2002. I think 2001. But yeah. You so how many times? Do you know? Um, there's some. Uh, there were some breaks in between from now. Breaks. Yeah, I because um, other stuff happened in life. <laughs> but yeah, Man, uh, I would say up in the teens. I uh, many times I've been so far. Yeah, and then um, JJ. Three. The times, basically, the times when we came back is when yeah. the times JJ went. Yeah. yeah. Now, yo, I, guys, I remember when JJ went to Otocon. That's first. Time. Toy he was like, oh, I need more money. <laughs> yeah. He went go get his mom. Like, yo, mom, I need mom, more money. <laughs> give me more money. I need more money. Transfer to my kids. And then Manny gave him money too. He's <laughs> like, <laughs> like, I remember when he surprised us. He's like, yeah, here's your birthday monies. He's like, oh, yeah. oh yeah, when I gave their, I get, yeah, I gave yeah, he's like, money. I gotta go back. <laughs> he, had, he ran back, he ran right back to the dealer room and bought more shit. Uh huh. But yeah, he. I'm surprised with him this year though. He chilled out. Yeah, he chilled out. All right, we're talking about Otakon now. But yeah, because we're because t- um we're not because we're not talking about our. I guess we can talk a little bit because but we're mostly talking about this one because. Yeah, um, I wasn't that super hype about going to Otakon because we went there a bajillion times, so it wasn't like the same reaction how we have with too many games. We're just like, yeah, yeah it's, like, like, it's just oh. like, it's like, it's chill, you yeah, know? Yeah, yeah, here we go again. Yeah, I was like, am I going back next year? I, I want to. Yeah, we'll see. But, um, because that, that's like, I'm trying to get a house, so we'll see what happens. But yeah. anyway, um, so this is our third time. This is Manny's 50th time. Third time? Like well, third time in a row. In a row. Third, okay. This what? is our fifth time, but this is our third time in the road. Third time that. in DC. Okay. Third time in DC. So this is our third time. This is Manny's fiftieth time of going. So 50th. this okay. time we were more prepared and on time of coming in at Otacon because we yeah. came here a day prior. I'm not, like we always, we always. Um, yeah, but because I'm talking about because comparison to too many games. Yeah, this we, year. We were, this year. we were late as fuck in too many games, but. Um, Otacon, we always go a day before the con starts on Thursday to our hotel because um, Manny right. works there as staff yeah, volunteer. But, um, I, was like, every, I think every year Manny's like, can y'all take Thursday off too? I was like, Manny, I'm already taking Friday off and Monday. He's like, but I got to go. <laughs> well, the, the, these past two, three years now because, uh, well, these past two years because I'm now on staff, I have to be there a day early. Mm-hmm. Yes. Guys, we get to skip lines. Yeah, I remember because um, if anyone if anyone remembers who been to Otakon the year prior, the two thousand two Otakon, knew about the shitty ass fucking lines there was going on right there. Luckily, because our uncle works there, we skip that shit. We we, we walk right behind him and look at all those people peasants. We in thoughts, put, not saying that loud, but no, no, no we like said it under our breath. Oh, you guys did walking um, by. <laughs> yes. They know what we were saying when we were looking. It's mm-hmm. like they'd be like, "Oi, what they doing over there?" <gasps> Fuck you. We're, we're, we're going inside, and then in the vendors' room before it opened. Oh yeah, people are asking, "Hey, are people coming in yet? Uh, already?" I'm like, "Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah people are coming. Yeah, they're in. coming in. Yeah." Uh, yeah, yeah, it's really slow right now. Yeah. Pri- privilege, yes, I know we were privileged. <laughs> Man, we got to look at everything. Yeah, yeah that's yeah, what they yeah, had. The first um, um, sight of every uh, item in, in their... I hope uh, next year our uncle goes to the vendor room so we can even just stick in there an hour early. Yeah, hey, could you stop doing that clappy shit? I'm sorry, I'm inside. But anyway, so we, you know, this year we, we um, well, yeah, the first, but um, the yeah. first year, 
I mean, the first day one of the actual con. Oh, before, oh hold up. Before that. So Thursday, um, we came. JJ didn't come with us. Yeah, because that's what I was going to bring up. He that JJ came in on Saturday. Yeah. So I uh, Friday. Yeah. He was on vacation in Florida. <laughs> So he came from vacation to go on another vacation. <laughs> yeah, I, remember, I remember when he told his parents, but I'm like, I have, I, I, you know, I still got to go to that car. Oh, crap, we forgot. Yeah, when he scheduled this trip. And, and Jake's like, oh, what the heck? I paid for this. I'm, I'm losing out a day. <laughs> yes, unfortunately. Yeah. So when, okay, Friday, it was just me, Manny and Nick. Manny go do what he had to do. Yeah, because he well, he only had free time for like three hours, and then, um, but well, two hours before I on my shift, and then three hours in between, and then the rest will have to get off. Yeah, but but when he gets off, like the, the all the dealer rooms are closed. Are closed yeah. So, but um, yeah, we we me and Mark most of the time just stayed in the dealer's room, checking out what they had there. It was not that bad to get in the dealer's room. Like first, it was a it was a long line. But then they they had to cut it at so they let some people in and then like half an hour later they start letting people in so it'd be easier I guess crowd control yeah so when we came back like two twenty we just walked right right walk yeah walk down there because uh, yeah the um, last year uh, there was a fucking wait we all had to sit in here like it's fucking we're about to go go buy Halo three or some shit. <laughs> And just wait there for a long while to get in. It was, there was a lot of people there too, but um, yeah, it was pretty easy getting in on day one. It, to be honest, it was pretty easy all days just to get in. Yeah, yeah, you just got. We improve our lining, our lineups and entrances because we we um, instead of just one way to get into the convention, we are allowed to have three entrances. Well, the the convention itself allows us to have three entrances. Yeah, so they, I, I, as far as I remember, they have one line for people with no badges. They have another line for people with bags. With bags, and they got and, another, and, and um, also with props of with their costumes, uh, with cosplaying, I should say. Then they have another line with no people, bags what? and no checking up their so, so there's three lines three the, lines. The, so there's one line in the front of the building one line on the on the side of the building and then another line where the hotel is connected to the building but well, well then that's four entrances then yeah, okay oh yeah that is yeah yeah that was pretty nice we, uh me and mark i unfortunately we were like oh we would have you know sanction our money and stuff you know spend a little bit today and spend a little bit next tomorrow and then spend whatever the last day, I kind of splurged too hard on day one. I'm, I'm not going to lie. I'm looking at my stuff. I splurged a little too hard on day one. I did as well. Because I spent more than half of my money that I saved for. Um, and I even had to delve into my bank funds for something else. I'm staring at you, you fucking mega man. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, me, um, I also splurged on the first day. But I, I, I didn't really spend everything. Like, last day, I, was, I just the Sunday, I just had to Force myself to be like, all right, let me see what I can get. You don't have, you don't, you don't have to spend money if you don't need to. Look, I, 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 that's just when I actually can literally look and see, oh, that's cool. But anyway, so first day, my biggest mission, I wanted a Japanese Sega Saturn. One, I want another color. Two, <sighs> it made it easier so... Me and Nick don't have to keep fighting over the uh, the RAM cart. Yeah, so if I want to play a Japanese game, I could just play with my Dreamcast. Mm. So the, I got I got it. I, I, there's it's the pictures on there. It's inboxed. I paid one fifty. I don't know if that was a, it was a great price. Nicholas check price check that shit. Yeah, I, mean, I don't feel like 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 let's not keep naming any of our prices because yeah. for overspending, underspending, yeah. all that stuff like that like that hundred percent doesn't yeah that's the, the deals man the deals I get the deals but we don't even know what the deals are. <laughs> we, we, we did we checked when we were in too many games but we didn't give a fuck when we were in the but um yeah that that was my big one I wanted it was just the Japanese um thing anything else was just I see something I want so yeah. My original plan when we were going to the imports booth was I was going to get a Super Famicom because uh, Mark had one and uh, I have a bunch of Super Famicom games. 
Yeah, and I got the Super Van Gogh when we were at too many games. So I already had one as well. So I wanted to get one, but then <laughs> when we were there, my brain changed because I saw something better. Because uh, <laughs> I bought myself a Japanese PS2 because I saw a bunch of cool ass fucking games there that I really, really wanted. But it also brings up then to mind that why uh, people might be thinking, why didn't we get these games while we're in too many games? Because um, well, too, well, too many games. They have Japanese games, but, but that's was, not a lot. Yeah, it was not their strong suit. Yeah, they mostly focus on American stuff. Yeah, yeah, only had like maybe a couple of vendors that had a couple of imports. Japanese. Yeah, yeah. Like I, I got, I got a couple of Saturn imports when we were there. But, um, me too. Yeah. Um, be honest, the thing that swayed me the most when I was there to get me the Japanese PS2 was, um, so, an, an, uh, well, we'll I'll, I'm showing this on screen, but we'll get into it, because I, I do want to play this for the channel, because, you know, anime games, that's fun, it's fun, it's fun <laughs> whatever, so, because I've heard about this game for a long time, because it was made by Capcom, and it's Capcom, they know how to make fighting games, mm -hmm. and it was like, I remember watching this anime, Back in the day, when you know when Funimation was still on TV, yeah, Kenichi, the mightiest, mightiest disciple. I remember that. And also this because I want to play more Smash clones for the channel as well. If anyone doesn't know what this is, uh, World Fighters, whatever the fuck it's called, because it's in Japanese, I can't read. Um, it's basically a Smash Brothers type game that has a uh, Hudson, Takara, Konami, and whatever. So you know, you see Bomberman fighting fucking. Optimus Prime for some fucking reason and all this bullshit like that the, these games is like okay no fucking I'm getting the PS2 I'm getting the PS2 you know the funny part is so when Nicholas that, when Manny came out came came to the dealer's room we, we got Manny the, the, the itch too yeah I, no that was on the second day yeah but you weren't originally going to get a Japanese PS2 oh, until uh, we talked about it not once we got to the booth and Nicholas like he, 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 he's behind Manny he's here but what, get, my worm tongue now? Get a Japanese PS2. You'll feel the power. Okay. And then Manny just <laughs> got pale. And could grow in a gray, gray beard. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> hey, 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 and I don't blame him because like, I went up when we were walking to that booth too, because I already bought a bunch of stuff, and then we walked to that booth again, and you're like, are you sure you're coming here, Nick? I'm like, I'm not, I'm not gonna buy anything, I'm just gonna take a look. And then I fucking buy the fucking Osu on the P on the DS, the sequel Osu game. This is a cool-ass rhythm game, everyone, if anyone knows what this is, they, they know what this is, you know, Osu or whatever. Yes. But I wasn't gonna buy it! Then I bought it! And then I bought Knights, the soundtrack, too! I wasn't gonna buy that either, but then I saw it! Knights! Uh, I bought that shit. We're not going through everything now, are we? No, but I'm saying how much if the, that fucking place swayed me. Yeah. It swayed you, too. Yeah, it swayed me, because I, I saw a lot of um, Japanese fighting games that no, I've never got. I, I also, Yu Yu Hakusho. I also bought some that, so that I don't normally buy. What soundtracks? Like, awesome. Music. I think, Maddie, I think Maddie, did you buy anything from there, music-wise? No, I did not. Oh, okay. You was tempted. He was tempted. tempted. I was looking for more records, but they mostly just got laser discs. I also found one of my... Uh, Holy Grails that I've been searching. Hold on, brother. Searching I didn't even her. say I bought my Pokemon. Yeah, you bought the soundtrack. Yeah, I bought the original soundtrack. I bought red and green, and technically, because blue is not on here. Soundtrack. Yeah, but um, I found one of my uh, Holy Grails that I've been, one of the games I've been searching for for a very, very long time because um, I always wanted a Sega Saturn for. So you guys are gonna walk away and then make a bunch of noise when I'm trying to explain my lust for the Sega Saturn. Oh, we we try to look, look, we're trying to look for like, but, but we try to make sure it's like, let me check see if there's any story stuff we got to talk about that we have. But um, yeah, but they can hear you in the background. So now it just kind of sounds like I'm gonna talk about my story, guys, and you both immediately walk away. <laughs> how would they not, how would they know us J walking J away? They, they, can, they can clearly hear the Manny shifting his bags around. Go no, you are not. We hear you probably see, we hear doors open. I look around. Oh my gosh, he's oh, looking man. too. JJ was there, though, Nick. You're not by yourself. JJ's there. That's not the point. <laughs> <laughs> but um. So I don't who pointed that out. I was like, yo, yeah, Nick. I didn't. Yeah, I didn't notice this. I'm glad you pointed that and out. He's like, yo, Nick, look. And he looks like, oh, because I like 
I was gonna buy some other stuff too, but then I, put, I had to put that shit back. Because, um, so I always wanted the Sega Saturn for a very, very long time. Way earlier before any of you fuckers wanted a goddamn Saturn. Like, I this, didn't really even, I didn't even want it. <laughs> like, I wanted this shit since like my teenage years. Yeah, because Manny didn't grow up with the Sega Saturn. Nope. Because I was a PS1, I was Sony. But we, we, just, we, we showed them the light. I was a Sony fanboy. We showed them the light. Because, uh, At least fighting game light. Because mm. um, I love Castlevania, and Symphony of the Night is my favorite Castlevania game. It's a, and, it's, it is to many fans. Yeah, but I, then I always heard of, there was a, just one version that had a bunch of content that was in, not in any other version, and even when they re-released this game, they don't put that content in the re-releases or anything. And the, Same thing with Mega Man, which is another one I want on the Saturn, which is Mega Man 8. But yes, I got I I, I Joe Dracula X Nocturne of the Moonlight, aka Castlevania Nocturne of the Moonlight, the Symphony of the Night, the Saturn version. It has a bunch of a lot of exclusive stuff, like extra areas, extra characters to play as that are not in any other version of the game. And uh, yeah, um, I played this on the emulator too, uh, for um, for the uh, the channel because I there is there is a Castlevania Symphony of the Night playthrough on the channel which is not finished yet. But I did, I did whip out an emulator to get the Japanese exclusive stuff to show it off. And, uh, I got through, I can get through that whole game without knowing what the fuck anyone's saying in this goddamn thing. That's how much I love this game. But, um, yeah. Um, so I bought that. that that's one of the big boys I was looking for for 5,000 years. And, and man, what, 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 what was, um, what was the game that you found that you wanted? I didn't really want to get any games. <laughs> My my main mission for this con was to get the um, Final Fantasy Tactics uh, figures, which I did find for him. Yes, because I, I couldn't go. Well, that was the first open. thing. That was the first thing you, you grabbed when um day, when day one. Came in. Yes. Yeah, because yeah, that um, was my mission. That was my journey. Yeah, because Manny missed them when they came out. Because I told him about them. I was like, just get them off of Ami Ami. And, 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 like, and you know, for me now, ah, I'll, get it later. I'll get it later. And then it was later, <laughs> and it was more expensive. I'm, I'm, I'm very terrible in procrastinating. Sorry. Yeah. So but sorry, when, not sorry. But whatever. when it came to this con. We we turned a worm tongue and got behind Manny's ear for what? So for all the gaming, get some video games. You don't ever forget. You are a collector. Oh my god! Okay. <laughs> and Manny's <he's> like, <laughs> <laughs> Gandalf uh, haven't showed up yet. Uh, he had never showed up. <laughs> Gandalf haven't showed up yet. But um, but yeah, uh, I basically got. Some imports as well, and then I got a PS2 import system, mm -hmm. which I wasn't planning to get. But since I, we they brought us to that one booth that had all the imports, I saw uh, several games. Oh, well, not several games, but a few games, fine games that I wanted because I'm a big fan of those. The anime that is uh, based out of one was Yu Yu Hakusho, and the other one was um, crap, what was it? I thought this was. I thought I was going through my collection. Did you, did right you get the uh, single couple Sora fighting? Yes, game? I got that too because I was a big fan of the anime. What? There was an anime. Single couple Sora wasn't it? I thought it was just a fucking Dice of Warriors clone that Capcom made. No, it was the anime. That one? Yeah, I have the anime. I have the um, Blu-ray collection. Maybe they made an OVA because I remember this was just originally just a game. Yep, they made an anime about it. Right. Which I didn't know there was a game, so yeah. Well, because most of the, the most of them don't didn't came out over here. Yeah, there's a couple. There's there's I think there's one on PS3 mm -hmm. that you can play. But um, yeah, so I got those those and um, I also got two games that I couldn't find. Um, one was uh about Records of Lotus War. I got yeah. the D lit. Yeah, I showed him that one, and then. The most hard to find because I don't know why Square Enix would like would like to tease people like oh we have oh, oh. this whole collection for all your fans but it's only for limited release and it's gone and it's gone day one and it's day gone. one it was the um, the collection the remastered collection of they yeah the pixel remastered that shit makes me so fucking mad <laughs> from one to six so in this one booth they had it for the Switch so I was like I have to get it how much was it it was a hundred. 
Okay, that, well, cool guess. I think that's actually. I think oh, that was the, that was the last. Art, uh, just today. I I last day. That's not last day. I thought what, that was the, second day. All the gaming I got was on second day. Second breakfast. Second breakfast. <laughs> but um, on my third Z's today, I got just the posters. Oh, and then right. for me, the Final Fantasy VII um, Advent Children posters. The thing, I, the things I got. The, the, I, I'll, I'll name three big games I got. I got Cyberbots. Because Nichols got Cyberbots and he didn't tell me, he took it from me. And then um, I got, oh, the game we played. Well, I, I already, that's my copy right there. I know, but I have but, mine. But uh, yeah, I already, I bought I bought that, like last year's Oldacon, Battle Stadium Dawn, which I I really wanted us to do as, as a recording for our first reactions. Because we do have the equipment to do it, but um, we, I, we just... We just popped that in and played it. And, well, I I wish we had the fucking four Luffy battle recorded. <laughs> <laughs> that shit was ridiculous. that was hilarious. That shit was fucking ridiculous. And I I guess I'll say the last game is probably the one that you told me about the Dreamcast. The, the one on the Dreamcast uh, you told me about what? Oh, Seven Cross Evolution. Yeah, you told me about that one, and I was like, I looked at it like. Okay. It's a very unique game. It it, it goes places. Like, like it might look jank as fuck, and I'm not gonna lie, it looks super jank as fuck. But it got fucking goes places. But um, I didn't really. Want, I knew because you know whatever is whatever we bought. I didn't want to heavily dive into what we bought on day one. Mm. No, we just did, we just say like highlights. So yeah. I got my my statues. And well, oh yeah, because uh, you never buy. Cause, well, I bought, look look. I I. I fucking buy a bunch of toys and shit and models and whatever, buildable models. Like, like I, I, brought the, I talk about the Mega Man X one, and I was about Duke Mon and whatever which for I, Digimon. Which I found. <laughs> yeah. I wasn't originally going to buy it, but it was fucking 30 bucks. And I was like, shit, I guess I'll buy it. <laughs> but I'm surprised there's more as Mark decided to get some fucking models. And, 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 a, and a, well, this is his uh, childhood favorite. Character. I know it's Digimon, Digimon, but like he bought mo I'm like, like I bought three. Yeah, you gotta put that because like I bought I bought Agamon that's already put together, and then I got War Greymon and Metal Gruma because I'm a big, I'm not big, I'm a Digimon fan. I love Digimon World. I like the Digimon World games. I like the anime. It was I grew up with it. I wanted it, and, that, and that's basically it. There was one I didn't want to look for, but at the time I was already running out of money. Um, Blue Eyes White Dragon. That is one of my favorite Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Yeah, I saw that there too. I'm like, because I have a I have a Kaiba figure, toy mm -hmm. Figma, whatever. I'm like, I kind of need the Blue Eyes too. And then, um, yeah, I'm a big fan of Yu-Gi-Oh also, but I was looking at those um, there was a uh, the figures, those huge figures about um uh, the um uh, Egyptian god um, uh, which one? Uh, that um, what color is it? It was uh, the, the one that had Kaiba had. Um, oh, uh, oh Atlas, the Tormentor. The Tormentor, uh, the Tormentor, and then they had the uh, the, the Golden Spinny. Oh, the Magic Mega Ultra Chicken. Yeah. The <laughs> chicken? It's a uh, Winged Dragon or Raw. Yeah, Winged Dragon Raw. Those two they had, but I wanted the red one. The Yugi. Scyther. Scyther, yeah. I got the, I got the, the, du the dual pack from um, the one of the, the places. I don't know if you used to notice that, Manny, but they had, they had the Millennium Puzzle there. And the cool thing about the Millennium Puzzle is that oh, they, okay. they, had, they don't give you instructions. You have to do it yourself. Like the show. Uh, so you have to put it together yourself. Without and, knowing, and then Manny puts and it on. And not knowing what to do. And you yeah. get, pos you didn't get, get possessed by a pharaoh, yeah. <laughs> Manny get possessed. I didn't know about it, so um, I didn't get it. So. And then um, I got... All right, can we talk about my story with Ultimate Muscle? Oh, yeah. Well, if within that story, just say, because anyone know, yes, yes. Despite us talking about fucking video games for 5,000 years, this is an anime convention and we actually bought some anime. Yes. But, um, yeah, uh, we were in this one booth. I got, uh, Sonic X of uh, the complete series. Uh, so they, they actually released the, uh, because they only originally released the English one because, you know, four kids and whatever. But Sonic fans, you know, it's Sonic fans, so they complain hard enough. So they finally released the, uh, Japanese version, which is in Japanese and subtitles, the one that isn't heavily censored in the four kids version. Mm -hmm. Sonic says shit at one point. <laughs> so yeah, so I got that. So because I never sat through Sonic X all the way through, I saw bits and pieces when they were on television, but I never really sat down and watched the whole thing because, uh, like with most people, I kind of think Sonic X kind of whatever. But 
you know, Sonic fan, need to experience everything because I'm fucking mm -hmm. crazy. All right, so I grew up watching Ultimate Muscle on four kids and you know, it was, I couldn't find anywhere to find it, to watch it. So I bought it. So this is the funny story. So we, me and Nick brought a bunch of stuff. We back, went back into the room. I realized, Nick, yeah, where's my ultimate muscle? Did you put it in my bag? No, I think I think I did. No, I, no. I, I put some. I put the Agumon in your bag when you asked me to. I, there was not. We did not do the ultimate muscle. So I was like, yo, I put my money away, but I didn't put the thing in the bag. So you just left it there and walked away. And I'm so glad yeah, you gave the the booth free money, basically. So basically, the guy was cool enough to be like, I told him, hey, I literally just left the thing here and just put my money away and walked away. He's like, oh, you left it here? Oh, well, here, I got you. Yeah. And he gave me, gave yeah, me, gave me one. Pretty cool guy. So I was like, yeah. yeah. And then I think, the, I think that's it. I no, think no that's... You, bought, you bought Golden Boy. Yes. <laughs> Golden. Oh, shit. Yeah, because we introduced you to that. Okay. Right? Well, I... My queen! Yeah, I would love to put a p clip on here, but you know how YouTube is. Yeah. But, um, yeah, I bought that. And bought some Filipino clothing line that oh, yeah. Manny told us about. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, I can't get over the fucking one with the jolly bean guy with surrounded by anime girls. <laughs> All right, so I guess Rouse 3 talked, and I'll let this let JJ so we can finish this up. Okay, well, I want to. Oh, oh, oh. You talk! Much. No, but well, we're because we talked about day one. We didn't. We didn't talk about Wicked City. Uh oh, uh, oh what, the, uh, the video of it. Yes. Oh, let JJ come in. Then we talk about it. That's okay. when he's with us. No, wait, no, he wasn't here. No, Wicked City. Yeah, talk about day one. Oh, okay, so, so, so me. okay, so Wicked City. Nicholas like told so, me about it. So we no, were. So we were like, this is Nick's uh, um his uh choice of what to do because we were bought a bunch of stuff and we we're like you know we weren't that crazy about doing going to the arcade and whatever. The arcade area, like the doing so, like for the next four, eight, like four to six hours. So we were like, well, we need something else to do because we were because um because Manny's staff, we get to stay there when everyone else leaves in the arcade area. And that's when we decide to do the arcade stuff. Yeah, but uh, we want to do something else instead. I made a suggestion go go look at some anime because there's there's a little there's little um theater rooms just to watch anime, and we were looking through the lineup. Uh, me and Mark were fortunately able to see a little bit of Golden Boy for fun. It was very fun. But when we were looking at the list, I'm like, oh shit, they got Wicked City. And I've seen clips of that shit. Well, you know, the, sc the scary bitch with the fucking vagina the mouth. And she's like a fucking spider or whatever. <laughs> yeah, so. Yeah, uh, I saw that no, shit. No, no, and I was, no, like, no. I was like, Mark, we gotta watch now, this. Now, let me talk about the beginning of this damn thing. All right, so the beginning of this damn thing, it literally was this guy picked up this girl. They go to they, they go to the to the, to the, her I guess her apartment. They start fucking, and then then she then her vagina turned into a, a mouth. Got him. Tried to eat him, but basically she just needed his semen. And then she left. And then um then he had he got a total mission to protect his old man. Then he got a partner that's also one of these things. And then uh, people done the world. Yes. Yeah. And, and then um. See, I think what this this is the part that got me. So she got basically her molested. She got salted by yeah. her ex. Well, you can say molested. It's fine. Molested by her ex because mm. her ex like it's you know assaulted. yeah assaulted. Yeah, well, yeah, he tried to he tried to kill because he's mainly trying to kill the old man and. He busted in and he basically he beat everyone up and then he ran to try to get the old man. But the girl was there, but they used to date. So he was like, I can't believe you're helping human. She's like, fuck you. He's like, I'm going to fuck you. And then things happened because it's an adult anime. Mm -hmm. And then um, then the guy came in. They killed him. Then um, Cause, they, uh, they, 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 then the old man escaped. Try, try okay, to go, okay, go, okay, go. Okay, we can't just go a full wait, synopsis wait, wait, of the no, whole no, fucking yeah, thing. Yeah, I'm, I'm supposed to be watching this. Yeah, too, Mark. The, the point we're, we're trying to make make a quick okay, review. Okay, no, you skip that part. The main thing that no, 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 I'm gonna still see my, my the parts of the fucking. Yeah, but that's what I want to bring up because no, let me let me so talk many. about. It. So then they got then they got another one where her ex boyfriend kidnapped her. Then had guys run train on her. Yeah, because that's one of the thing I wanted to bring. I was like, I don't know what what why they up. Uh, it's because they want it's horny. They wanted to make it horny, but the, like this girl. Like she's supposed to be one of the bad, like, you know, the badass like the guy is. Mm -hmm. But for some fucking reason, every time a villain shows up, they're, they're having their way over. 
She becomes a damsel in distress. Yeah, for some the, the first it was the X, and then it was that weird parasite that put they put his tentacles in her mouth, and then and then, then there was the boys who ran there a train. There was another on X that that had a whole bunch of boys run a train on her, and then like the main character is like, oh, despite this woman getting molested by every other man in the universe for some reason. I'm still in love with her. And now and then, I want to bang her. And then, and then, and then I remember I was so confused. Like, are we dead? I, the, yes. Yeah. So like, don't like, say too much yeah, more. Yeah. Like, and then, they, then they fucked. Yeah. The, 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 yeah. They did just fuck. They fucked in a really random ass scene. Yeah. It was weird. We thought it was, it was a dream. No. Yeah. No. I, we thought they were, you know. And there was parts that we thought that the, the anime was going to end. Yeah. Like, I, I'll say this right now. Um, Act three didn't need to be there. Act three went like Act two should have ended where it was, and then the movie ended. But then yeah. Act three just it just kept going. It was how I felt with the fucking Batman movie, the latest one. Like I like the Batman, the new one, but the, like there was a point where I'm like, the shit ain't over yet. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, it was crazy. Yeah, it was a very very crazy anime. Now this one was better than the damn second one that he had us watching. <laughs> Well, but that's in day two. Let's get into day two now. Before that, like now, now JJ enters the scene. Yay, hey, I'm here. He wo- yeah, we woke up early in the morning. Um, <laughs> yeah, he took a long drive up from Florida. To I think. Here. I think like he literally showed up when Manny w- left. Yeah, yeah. my shift. And then um, he came. We talked. Okay, JJ, go t- talk about wh- how- what happened and then what you got. <sighs> All right, so basically, first thing in my mind, getting up the room, oh yes, I I have to get Oshinoko figures. That's <laughs> that's the anime I've been watching. I, that's my favorite right now. I gotta get those. Quote, unquote, anime. You still have no idea what this is. Guys, please, please let these people know that it is real. It is a real anime. <laughs> I don't know, man. These people are telling me I'm delusional. <laughs> There's no figures in the con. If this was an, a pop it, anime, it should... it's popular right now. Yes. Does, does anime exist? It does. Are you sure? Someone, please <laughs> help me out. Is, your, is, your, is that really your waifu? <laughs> they are. They are. are. Are you sure? There's three. Three of my favorites. Are, are you sure you there. didn't make these three people up? <laughs> <laughs> is, this, is this fan service or are we going? No. And, and before someone doesn't fucking get it, because I know people are, it's a joke. This is a joke. We are fully aware this is real. Yes. Please, for fuck's sakes, it's a joke. But, um, but anyway, it was like, it's like, um, it's like, but, but um, yeah, he, so go ahead, continue. But just walking around. Couldn't find it. Couldn't there was find nowhere. It. Nowhere to be found. Only the arts. But no figures. Oh, yeah. The, um, whenever you get around, just text me the fucking name to that so I can put at least what that character is on screen. Yeah. Oh, yeah, sure. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. So that was your mission. Them. That was my you mission. You failed on I that failed. Mission. I was disappointed. He was trying to look for the Chinese guy. Yeah, I tried looking for the, the guy that was selling the figures for a good deal. But then, I only found them at the last day. <sighs> we technically, I guess, me, Nicholas, and Manny found them, but we didn't know that was the guy. It was the guy that sold the t-shirts. That we oh, bought. okay. It was like, yeah, we didn't know that was the guy, though. But he didn't have the figures, though. He did have figures. He, he was did. Only- it was on the left side, though. Oh, okay. Yeah, he usually has the shirts on, like, a different section. But he he had any of the ones you wanted. Well, there was like one thing he the JJ did debated uh, the Minato uh, figurine, but I decided I'll hold off. You want your life, boo? Yeah, <laughs> my focus is my priorities were set straight. I couldn't. Okay. Yeah, but also something that's special is is um, <laughs> is um. <laughs> The fact the t- gosh fuck it. <laughs> Just, uh, but um the the thing that uh, is me and Manny and Mark we don't give a fuck about doing cosplay. Uh, we we appreciate the craft and we love taking pictures and girls are cute. But um we Definitely. don't do we don't do cosplay. But our uh, uh, JJ decided to do some cosplay. Yeah, time. but uh JJ decided to do a little bit of cosplay. I, I, I did one. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he, yeah he, he cosplayed Tactical Maid. Mm-hmm. He, he, uh, Probably going to continue doing it. But no, I was just going to say, he's being exposed. The, the agency is real. The, the agency is real. 
Tactical maids are real. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But uh, yeah, because uh, you you got you got you know, people who approach you to take some pictures of you. Yeah, about like ten. Yeah, mm-hmm. it was pretty fun. Mm-hmm. Met some new people, cool people. Mm-hmm. And then there's one guy who. Oh yeah, there, there was there was one person that was a little questionable. <laughs> came what? came up to me. And you want a duel? What? <laughs> duel what? <laughs> what, are we what, doing? You, what are we doing? <laughs> Yu-Gi-Oh! What? <laughs> like, what, what duel? <laughs> and he, and he, he like wrapped his hand around his fake magnum on his on his left side. I was like, oh, oh, oh that, that duel. Kind of duel. I just walked away. <laughs> mm. uh, not, none of that. Mm-hmm. I, ain't, I, ain't, I ain't pulling out the gun. I ain't pulling out no gun. <laughs> but, even, um, even if it's a play gun. Yeah. But uh, it, is, I mean, is that, did you is that, get anything out there? Uh, I, I, oh yeah, yeah, I, yeah, I got two shirts. Two shirts, yeah, that's right. Uh, the Jolly, Jolly Bay. <laughs> oh yeah, <laughs> gotta take a picture of that and put yeah, that on the screen. Yeah, they, they, um, um, yeah, they, we'll mm, take a picture of that later. Yeah, name name the um, well, Manny to Tech Nicholas the the name of the store. Oh yeah, we, <laughs> shell. I don't give a fuck. I'm Filipino. I'm f- that fucking shell. It. I'm gonna shell the fuck out of this thing. <laughs> 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 but uh, yeah, we'll put that on the screen. Yeah, they, um, we bought the shirts. Well, I didn't buy anything because it didn't have what I want on my size. Yeah. But uh, there they sold like a bunch of sh- t-shirts and stuff. Uh, jackets. jackets and jackets. Yeah. Oh, uh, anime um, it's influence. Influence, yes. Because yeah. it, it's, it's not like based on anything. It's just anime. Yeah. Style mm-hmm. shirts and stuff, and jackets and whatever. Yeah. Hats. It's nice. Yeah. Gotta represent our country. Yep. Yeah. All right, that, I think that's it. Filipino, Filipino. Yeah, that's mm-hmm. the second day. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Well, the anime of the second of day. The, of the <laughs> night. What was it? What was it called? Geo Geo. <laughs> yeah, Geo. Look, look, look. I don't know if anyone can agree that Geo Cyber is kind of a little out all over the place. Because we jumped in on episode two, so yes. maybe we don't know the context because we didn't see episode one. But episode two was a fucking trip and it was hilarious. So let me just describe it so fucking fast. So Geo Cyber had these friends, but then these helicopter killed her friends. And she's like, what the fuck? And she killed the helicopter. And then the, 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 but then the kids came back as ghosts and attacked the other helicopter people made them kill themselves. Yeah, haunting them, basically. Yeah, and then just, but, uh, so, yeah, there were ghosts for some reason. And then, like, the, the, the people on the boats were making their own super he- the fucking monster. And then the and then the little girl who turns into the super monster, the G- the Geo Cyber, mm-hmm. which goes to the boat and then meets the the, um, the the robot, and then they fought, and then like the mother who apparently lost her child due to an aircraft. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, we showed that clip. Hopefully, you can show that clip. I, I'll try to show that clip, but it's uh, we'll see what happens. But it, it was very fucking funny because the the, the plane explodes, and you just see the daughter fly in the air. <laughs> Because even that us was laughing, but the whole people in that um, room was what, laughing too. Come here, like, what the hell? It was so on? random. Like, why would they show the scene? Well, no, the scene. Well, the, it, she was dreaming. The mother was yes. dreaming it. But it, it just it, the like, way it, the, the anime was. Yeah, it was funny. all over the place. Like you, you could take understand what they were all trying to tell you. Yeah. But it was happening all at once with all this other bullshit. Yeah. Because like the the like, the robot thing that was supposed to be a monster. It took over the boat and then killed literally everyone. Yeah, it was except there for to, the mom. Yeah, it was there to protect them, but instead it went crazy, crazy. Because, because the science man. The, yeah, the, well, no, the science man was crazy and let him do it. Yeah, and then the mom went nuts too, which I don't blame her because all this shit was happening all around her. And um, in the end. <laughs> we, we, we had a heart to think destroy the city yeah like, we what? were having a hard discussion like who's the who's the hero who's the, who's the protagonist yeah, i think it was i don't know it was manny or nick told me that's the hero so that was like that was me i was like no oh, she's the hero because yeah. she's trying to save her friends and then i'm looking at like and then she's i see her destroy the, the city and then, bad guys and then destroy the city oh uh, random city like, uh, and i looked at uh, maddie i'm like manny how, this ain't no hero. This is a villain. She's still the hero. She, she, she's just attacking no, the villain. No, no, those kid ghosts were the villains. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Do it. <laughs> they made the motherfucker kill himself. 
and uh, then, wow. It, it was it was a, up there. And, I want more Geo Cyber. I want to like. Oh, I need to find that shit and yeah, watch, watch the whole thing. Things. Yeah, like, that shit was a fucking trip, man. We saw only like two episodes of Just that. Two episodes. Yeah. And it was fucking. We didn't even finish the fourth oh, and episode. Was another, and it was another fucking. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. So <laughs> so so there was this dude and her and his blind girlfriend. They were in this shitty place, and we were like, "Where's Geo Cyber?" Yeah, but but the, in, the, in this story, Geo Cyber is now. Um, God, a, a guardian god that's been left away for five thousand years in, in, in sleep. sleep, and it will be released at some point. But there was this one dude with his uh, blind wife. He uh, he went to a gig and whatever, and he was like, you know, pleasing the rich people, throwing knives. He's real good at that. No, with, that with blindfold. Was, oh yeah, yeah. yeah. No, was, no, no, was, no, I'm fast forwarding him, Mark. But he didn't even see the part where he did it on the streets. So that doesn't matter. The, the point the, the sex it was no the sex happens after the no, the, no the sex happens after he murders the guy that's why he wins her it's like we gotta get out of here no nick the sex happened when he said we gotta do one more job then we can leave yeah well cause what because they didn't have any money yeah they have enough yeah okay okay you okay. went too far okay yeah. so she's like <laughs> the funny thing is like what's wrong we don't have enough money and they just admit they're, they're having this conversation and they're fucking yeah, I thought well, we got to try to get our doctor to help me. Is this supposed to help me? <laughs> this dick's gonna help you, girl. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, that, another like random yeah, ass man, sex man. scene for no reason. I was like, man, ninety loves the these set damn sex scenes randomly. Like I said, when we were watching this, they will never make this type of shit ever again. Not this time, unless it's hentai. But yes, it was. Just, yeah, yeah, but hentai would just be funny. Like they're not gonna go all out like Geo Cyber with all this animation and shit. Yeah, with all this action drama. <laughs> well, no, the thing is, I never so, so, uh, psychological war. I never seen any hentai. It just randomly just this from a situation. Yo, we just fuck, dude. dude it, it's the one that I have. The one with the gun kata shit. Like it's like a fucking action movie, and then they realize, oh wait, this is a hentai. So they have like one sex scene out of the world because the girl falls asleep and then she dreams of her getting fucked by her fucking job friends and that just happens yeah. and then he's like oh and then it goes back to the fucking gun shit again and you're like oh wow this movie's cool i, I almost forgot this was a hentai <laughs> like that shit happens it happens okay how old is that how old is it um i think it's like i think it might be early 2000s oh, kind of old but anyway yeah we saw that and it was crazy um that's basically it For i mean day two day two i mean lately we bought some games yeah i mean we already, it's about like, about we, already we already talked about what we did on day three day two yeah i just bought some shirts yeah bought a crack i mean not we crack. bought crack uh i didn't buy crack the gamer subs that, that's it but um and uh, sleep caught up to you because you went yeah i went to sleep early mm, he, he, he the, said he was going to try i was yeah. going to try and stay up but i really could not he 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 got a little um excited with that genocide movie in the, in the initial I, scene yeah <laughs> like but because wow what a way to start like in, so, like the first scene is first scene and now it isn't like new animes where they'll cut away of the kids getting blurred no yeah. literally you get in these scenes these kids get obliterated like yeah. body parts spewing everywhere and, bullets and, going and through was like, oh my splattered. god this is awesome <laughs> like oh shit i'm, I'm awake now <laughs> i'm awake now and then all of a sudden i saw that uh, GL Cyber just turned into a monster. I was like, what? And now you're like, oh, I gotta use my brain, but I'm sleeping. And yeah. You, you left. And I, he's like, the, he's like, the violence is gone. <laughs> the excitement's the over. Yeah. yeah. Got a fucking GL Cyber. Uh, but yeah, that was day two. Eric got to talk about day three. Yeah, day three yeah. was kind of just whatever. We didn't, yeah. it was just kind of just yeah. say, take a look at everything before. One last. One less. Uh, I, mean, I, mean, I bought some more stuff, but I mean, like, I just yeah, like I said, I, I bought my um, three Final Fantasy yeah, Adventure posters. Yeah, and I just bought Mango. Mango, Mango. Man Man oh yeah, we were privileged. We got to see stay at the end, <laughs> stay at the dealer's room. Everybody was gone. I looked around. Yep. Mm -hmm. And then, yeah, there uh, we may have uh, one stop at uh, one of these uh, booth. We had some Pokemon plushies. Which I need to um, look for uh, Mew, but yeah. Man, Raichu! I wanted it! Yeah. yeah. 
and we and I took a couple of swigs of this energy drink. Didn't think it was energy drink. I thought it was a uh, actual fruit juice. <laughs> I, I drank four of them, and I was like, "Woo!" Mm. I had a lot of energy. <laughs> Man, like, Woo! They work. They work. Yeah, Maggie that's, started that's running around the dealer it. room. Yeah, yeah I was I like, I didn't feel tired to walk around. Mm. I, my legs were not tired until yeah, until now. No, still. Oh, you need more. You need more energy drink. No, drink I have packets. Yeah. I have it. No, I'm good. No, no, it's pour some that. that, that I don't want to sleep. Okay, but, but by the way, when I say the word mango, it's just because I usually say that a lot. Again, I'm pretty sure not everyone's going to understand my context. I'm, I'm talking about mango. Manga, manga. Mangoes. Yeah, I say mangoes just to be funny. We're but talking, yeah, I'm talking, talking about, about fruit. Man, talk about manga, yes. But, but yeah, that was the third day. Yeah, that was that, that was mostly it. We went to an after party and whatever, and that was fun and whatever. Free but, food. Yummy, yeah. yummy. But yeah, that that's it. That, that was Otakon. Most of it was just, you know, buying stuff and then experiencing really weird old ass anime. <laughs> yeah, like th this year was normal. More, yeah, it was more casual. Yeah. Just yeah. another year. Yeah, and then they got rid of all the um the pandemic um I can breathe. Yeah, yeah, no more masks. No Fuck more yeah. Masks. No more masks. I can breathe. No more no more vaccine checks, all that's all gone, thankfully. Yeah, I could not stand that from last year. Yeah, last year, man, it got hot. I mean, I had to lift the mask a little bit. Like, <sighs> yeah, and, and if we had that at this uh, weekend, because it was hot. Yeah, it was in the 90s. Close to 100s with the uh, humidity. By the way, I saw the initial D car there. Oh, you did? Oh, yeah, 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 that, yeah. That's because, you know, running in the 90s. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Funny. <laughs> but, yep, that was Otakon. I didn't really experience the thunderstorm. I wasn't here. Oh, yeah, you weren't here for that. Oh, yeah, I did see the I... trees. Why was there like a big tree that fell down? Oh, I guess the thunderstorm, I guess. That's crazy. Because it, was, it wasn't raining as hard with like the previous weeks. Was it Friday? Was, that was yesterday. It, no, it was Friday. Okay. It did it was, rain a bit Saturday, though. Because, um, like, when when I was working, when, when I'm going to when I, when, when I went to work, it rained so fucking big, like thunderstorm, like the thunder every two seconds. And no, it did. It did rain on Saturday, though. and it rained. It, it may, it might have, but I don't. Know. It was a. Well, it, it was a quick bad. burst. It was a quick burst. Yeah, it wasn't as bad. No, it was a quick burst because then some people were in line and they got wet waiting, but. People's makeups got messed up, stuff I, like that. Another man. No, like, the, the, uh, there was like a group of um, young guys who was um, trying to make their way. And they got caught in the flash or uh, thunderstorm. And they got in with wet. <laughs> mm. Yeah, so they had to walk around the town all wet. Yeah. My condolences. Oh, yeah. see, look, you, that's terrible because you you walk around all wet and then it's air conditioned, and so you you'd be like freezing cold. Well, I felt got felt bad for those guys, yeah, but yeah, that's just how it be sometimes. Yeah. Use the tunnel. Uh, just, secret tunnel. Uh, secret, secret tunnel. tunnel through the hotel. Oh, no. Secret, <laughs> secret, secret, secret tunnel. And uh, oh, no. I, I but, the dark. But yeah, that's um. Uh, that was Perfect. it. That was it for uh, I, I Despite me saying that we're, this is going to be the shorter one, it technically is because we're at the forty-minute mark. And too many games was like an hour. Yeah, okay. But um, yeah, that's. That's it for the cons. I don't know how much with the how much looping the footage. I'm not gonna keep infinitely looping all this footage because I'm pretty sure that that would get annoying at a certain point. You can loop uh, Alan <laughs> doing the loop. <laughs> <laughs> I, I would watch that. <laughs> oh my! What, what we were like me and JJ were just uh, testing his system. Yeah, we were on the on the bed just waiting. Yeah, and then all of a sudden. I was just burst and jump, dive and made a roll, like <laughs> crash into the wall. Like, what the heck is going on? <laughs> <laughs> You're like, all right, I'll jump. And he actually did it. Fr like, fright frightened them too. Oh. Jump. Mm. No one, Alan. We would. I wouldn't think that he would yeah, do that I, kind of thing. He's exactly. like he's very. He's very um calm and. Uh, right. I, I guess kind of reserved. Reserved dude. Yeah. He's an Asian. Yeah. That's a typical Asian, I guess you could say. But um but yeah. He did that bro. <laughs> man, man is like crashed into the man is like man is like whoa. Yeah, yeah when he gave it whoa. Yeah, he almost hit his head. I was on shocked. The, he almost hit his head on the fucking suitcase. Yeah, yeah. the wheel parts. Yeah, that's why I, I put you there to catch him. Yeah, but I didn't. I didn't, I was I was not prepared. To be honest, <laughs> was not, who was prepared? 
Who thought he was just gonna <laughs> actually do it that hard? <laughs> I was like, I, I was like, I, he yeah, followed, I he followed through. Yeah, he's like, uh, he's like, he's like, I trust Mark. And the stunt I gave him this the the script stunt, and went. Yeah, stunt double supreme over here. <laughs> that, there's our Jackie Chan, but he's from Vietnam. <laughs> okay, <laughs> but um, anyway, guys. So, uh, yep. So. That was too many games, and th- and then Otocon. So 2023. Yep. So, uh, go ahead, Nick. Uh, well, obviously, before like we can always say who watch one was our favorite album too, which obviously which was like, too many games. Yes. For this year, yes, it was too many games. It uh, helped us accomplish what our our, our collection our, needs. Yeah, our current obsession. Yes. yes. But um, yeah. Um. I didn't expect this to be two and a, almost two hours. I might split these into. I'm gonna split these into parts. Yes. Because um, one for too many games. Part one for and, two. <laughs> yeah, and one for Oricon. But uh, um, yeah. I'm Nick. I'm Mark. Manny Fresh. JJ. And this is Bit Runners trying through video game worlds bit by bit. Thanks for what for well listening. I guess because not really watching. <laughs> well, I guess there's stuff to <laughs> look at. Clips, yes. Yeah, but mostly just listening. So like, comment, and subscribe. And hit that notification bell. And also, if you have any suggestions or comments or anything, hit us up on Twitter. Like tidbits. Mm-hmm. And also, or funny bits. <laughs> yep. And then we, oh, yeah, yeah. If you want to or, help us deny of um, JJ's fake waifu, <laughs> they're real. <laughs> I'm telling you, they're real. <laughs> sure. I'm not schizo. We might have to call the crazy people. Mm-hmm. But, um,. Oh uh, yeah, and, and then also we uh, stream on Twitch. Yeah, yeah, well, we haven't been streaming recently, but yeah. Um, so yeah, all right. Uh, I can't really. This is remember remember pre game podcast guys. Yeah, I you, only, you, only, you only did we only did it twice, mm-hmm. but um, I guess we'll see you guys next time whenever we uh, do another podcast. Maybe yeah, whenever that happens. Yeah, so. If you if you like it, yeah, we can we'll probably make more. Bye-bye. Bye bye. Bye. See ya. Peace.